Avadil Kumar sharing with you an excellent question on geometric distribution. In a game of gambling, a player tosses a coin until a head appears. He then gets 3 times n dollars where n is number of tosses. What is the probability that the player receives 12 dollars? What can be the fair cost of this game? So these are two parts to the question. So let's do part A and then we'll do part B. What is the probability that player receives $12? So $12 player receives, which is $3 times N. So from here we can say 12 divided by 3 is N or N is equals to 4, right? N is number of tosses. So there are four tosses. Okay, now it says, what is the probability that the player receives $12? That is to say that there was tails, 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 and then head. So that is a kind of toss. So there are three failures and then a success. Correct? We need to find this probability. What is the probability for this? Three failures and a success. Correct? That is how you can understand this. Now let me calculate the probability here. So we are saying that we have, we are saying heads is a success, right? So we are saying tails or a failure, failure, failure and then head. Now when you toss a coin, we are assuming this to be a fair coin. So the probability for success or head is equals to half and probability for failure which is q for us is also half correct so in this case what is the probability so the probability in this case for head whatever you may say is half to the power of three times half right so that is what the probability is or one over two to the power of four is it okay so that is the probability in this particular case, which is 1 over 16, right? Now, second part of this question is, what can be the fair cost of the game? What can be the fair cost of the game? So let's find the fair cost of the game. We can find it from the expected value, right? We can find it from the expected value. Now in a geometric series, the expected value is one over P, right? Is one over P. Now probability is half, so it is one over half so which is equals to 2 right so basically expected value is 2 so the amount which you get so you need to do two tosses that means two toss is expected that is mean number right this is also the mean right let's say mu is 2 since dollar 3 is what you get so in dollars, this becomes three times two, which is six dollars. So in this game, the fair cost is six dollars. So fair cost of the game should be six dollars, right? If it is more than six dollars, then the person is losing money in every, every trial, right? So I hope that helps you to understand the concept. I'm Anil Kumar. You can always share and subscribe my videos. Thank you and all the best.